Hello everybody, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. I am so happy you're here. Today is Vlogmas Day 8. If you're new here, hi, I'm Maddie. I'm a K-5 STEM teacher and ed tech coach in Los Angeles. I post weekly tech tutorials for teachers, and during this period called Vlogmas, I'm posting a new video every single day for 25 days up until Christmas. So like I said, today is Vlogmas Day 8, and I am so happy you're here. So for today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys some really cool Google Drive URL tips and tricks. I love these secrets of Google Drive. You might have heard of some of them before. Some of them might be brand new to you. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is learn how to create a new file quickly. So we're gonna go up to the search bar here and we're just gonna type in slides.new and you'll see that it will actually create a new slides presentation when you click enter. This works for docs, sheets, etc. Now we're gonna take a look at how to force people to make a copy of your Google Drive file. So we'll go up to the URL here. We'll delete everything, including and after the word edit. We'll type in copy, we'll press enter, and now you'll see that with this new URL, students will be forced to make a copy of your file. Now we're gonna take a look at this preview trick. The way that this works is basically you can share a file with students so that it doesn't have this big bar at the top with all of this distracting information. So if you go up to the URL, you delete everything, including an after the word edit, type in preview, press enter, you'll see that the document is clean to share with students. Now it also works for Google Slides. This is a great way to share slides with students in full screen presentation view. So normally they have to click on this present button in the top right corner to open the slides in presentation view. But with this URL trick, you can actually delete everything, including an after the word edit, type in preview, press enter, and now the slides are gonna be in full screen presentation view for students. You'll notice that there is this small bar in the bottom left-hand corner here. You can actually delete this by taking it just one step further. So if we go back up to the URL, delete everything including an after the word preview, type in preview question mark RM equals minimal. Then we click enter, you'll see that, that now there's no bar at the bottom. Thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed these Google Drive URL tips. If you liked this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're not already. I post weekly tech tutorials for teachers and I'll see you back here soon. Bye friends.